What's up everyone? Welcome back to another video. And today we've got one of the best products to ever come out of tops. Should be on the Mount Rushmore of baseball cards for me. Stadium Club Chrome is chef's kiss with my knife. It took ages for it to come out over here and I'm glad they brought it back. There was talks that they weren't going to, it wasn't going to be coming back. Why aren't you staying in focus? But thank God it did because it's an awesome, awesome product. I love it. Um, I can't find any hobby boxes over here though, which is kind of annoying. I don't, one place did have them up for pre-order and I kept checking back and then it just said uh, sold out. So whether they sold out the pre-order and didn't get any extras in maybe, I don't know, but at the moment it's still sold out. So we have to be stuck with blaster boxes. So this will be my little, I can't put that in the bin, so I don't, I'm trying to be a bit cleaner. So I usually just chuck everything on the floor. Camera illustrate, there we go. But I've got my sleeves ready. I'm gonna get them out now so that I don't mess it up if we get something good. So yeah, I'm just waiting on the hobby box, hopefully to come back in stock. Whether it will or not, I don't know. Might just have to get some more blaster boxes of it. They blasted in pretty good from what's in from other people who have opened this product up. There's some pretty decent pulls to be had. I think you get, um, oh, it says on the exclusive X Factors. I can't remember how many you get on, I thought it was one in every pack, but I don't think it is. I can't remember. But so we've got one, two, three, four packs. Yeah, four packs, I don't know why. Seven card pack, oh, that's fine. I'm not gonna start at the bottom, I'm actually gonna start on the top pack. Let's go from top to bottom. Oh, it drives me insane, because they'll be messed up. I know they're not in any order. But you know what I'm like. We've got the Chrome, so don't know why. I can keep the phone out of this, unfortunately. Simon was your rookie card, though. Let's get the knife out of the way, because it'll probably stab me in the finger like it did last time, which is only just healed. Uh, Luis Heal rookie. There's our first X Factor. It's going to be Joe Adele. We'll keep out an eye out as well for our oh, Mookie Betts trophy on this. These are pretty cool inserts. Does kind of remind me of something like Panini would do, but I think they're pretty cool. I'm going to sleeve up the Joe Adele X Factor and the Mookie bets. Oh, we've got Beam Team as well, straight away. See, there's something that really grinds my gears about these Beam Team cards. They look awesome, I think, as usual. This off-center design is driving me mental. I absolutely hate it. Just put it in the middle and have like the circle in the middle. Just make the circle bigger and run it off either side. Why is it? Why is it off-center? It's just awful. But they still look pretty cool. I think I probably prefer the Beam Team one from 2020, 2022, I think, with a better design. There's Zach Wheeler. And finish it off with uh, El Ferris Montero. I can never pronounce his name, so apologies. I always forget how to pronounce his first name. These cards are super bent, like, not even just bent like a chrome would be in the middle, like that. They're bent like, I'm not going to bend them even more, but... You know what I mean. Right, we've got Tati starting it off. Uh, Larry Walker, Julio Arias, and then we got what we've got in the middle, Carl Hendricks. In a hitting pose as well. That's interesting. Is that is is that an image variation? That is hitting on there. I can uh, I don't know if it says. I'll have to look have a look or let me know if it is an image variation. I don't know why they'd have him hitting. It's a bit weird. He came back last night, took the loss, unfortunately. He hasn't pitched since July last year, I think. Uh, Matt Brash, rookie card, Frankie Montas, and Anthony Rendon. Yeah, I don't think Carl Hendrick has pitched since July last year, if I'm remembering correctly, because he had that shoulder problem. And apparently, it took him so long to come back because he opted not to have surgery, apparently. So he's just waited for it to heal. But yeah, didn't have a great outing last night, which kind of sucks for him. Um, hopefully, he'll be all right. Uh, we've got Merrill Kelly. Jose Ramirez. Our X Factor is Yon Moncada on the Field of Dreams. And then another Nolan Arenado team team. It's not the Wave Refractor. This one, no, it's just the normal one. So that's great. Getting two of the same one. Perfect. Why wouldn't you want that? And then Fran Reyes in his Cubbies uniform. And Dontrell Willis at the end. And I suppose I should sleeve up the Beam team again and the X Factor. We've got an X Factor in each pack. We have, yeah. So I was right. You get one in every pack. 
Yeah, we do. Not too bad. I guess that's pretty cool. Right then, last pack. Pray for some last pack magic. There's Tom Glavin playing ice hockey, which is pretty cool. I always like this card. And then we have Reggie Jackson, X Factor of Cal Raleigh, rookie card. And then we've got Team of the Future, Will Smith. And then Matt Olson, Hunter Green, rookie. Brian Reynolds finishing it off. So that's our not numbered, I don't think. It'd be on the front, I suppose, isn't it? They don't put numbers on the back top, do they? That's the only Panini, I think, do that. Where's the uh, Cal Raleigh rookie? No, that's Rick Jackson. Go on, why can't I find it? Oh, there it is. So there we go. Blaster box of Stadium Club. Not too bad. Would have been nice not to get two Nolan Arenado beam teams, but what are you going to do? Um, the X Factors, not too bad either. Got the rookie card, which is pretty decent. Carl Hendricks will go in the Cubs PC. Joe Adele, and then the Mookie Betts trophy hunters. So there you go. That's all right. I might, be, I might have to get another one and see if we can do better than that. Let me know what you think in the comments. Oh, as I click the camera over right at the end there. Yeah, let me know what you think in the comments down below. Hit the like and subscribe if you're new here. I really appreciate it and it really helps the channel out. And I'll see you in the next one.